previously on Minecraft Story Mode. Everything in the universe starts out as just a block. What comes of those blocks is up to those who wield them. And in every block, there lies the potential to create or destroy. Our friends have traveled far and wide in search of the Order of the Stone. And a way to stop the Wither Storm for good. But even well-laid plans can go awry. The strong can grow weak. And beloved heroes can fall. And though some glimmer of hope may remain, the threat to this world, to its very existence, is far from over. So yeah, guys. Storm isn't dead yet, not even close. The what now? Who are you? <clears throat> Jesse, Jesse, where are you? Help him. Say something, Jesse! We're over here! No way, no way! You found Gabriel? Who's Gabriel? <clears throat> Condemning them to death. Just Stop moving. staring and get a move on. <laughs> well, I can't just abandon them. Not after a lifetime of study. Your head's gonna be abandoning your body if you don't turn around and run. Get the horses. Jesse! They're falling behind! Axel, you gotta move faster! She's too sick. This is the best we can do. They're not gonna be able to outrun it. Not on foot! We gotta find a way to move faster. We're all gonna be caught in the tractor uh, beam. So we just need to get them moving faster. <clears throat> the horse is perfect. Bingo! Everybody, get on! That's a crazy intro so far. Come on, horses! Whatever you do, don't look back. Ah! <coughs> I look. Ruben. Everyone, follow me. Dodge the creepers. This Jesse, is the worst ride of my life. Axel, stop I'll backseat steering. I can't help it. I'm getting horse sick. Skeleton riding. Go and hit it. Hey, look, it's a zombie chicken. It's gaining on us! No offense, but you could use a little practice. 
First time on a horse here. Watch it! You try to knock me off this thing, Jesse? Sorry. saying some pretty weird stuff back on that horse. He might have wither sickness. I don't know. You never acted the way he's been acting. I'll go talk to him. Yeah, you go do that. Hey, how are you feeling? I'm afraid I don't feel much like myself at the moment. Gabriel, it really is you. Oh, I knew if anybody could outrun death, it would be you. Uh, who are you people? It's me, Eligard. Come on. <clears throat> Old friend, don't you recognize us? Really? It's Soren. We've known each other he for know me either. a very long time. He doesn't recognize me either. Well, he only just met you. But for him to forget us? You! You're the one who rescued me! Tell me, please, what is going on? I remember only blackness. And then... Suddenly you, were, you were there. You were caught in the Witherstorm, trapped. For how long? Long enough that it did this to you. It felt like an eternity. It was dark and foul, and I was sure I was a goner. Well, you aren't. You made it back alive, which is more than I can say for some of us. <sighs> Magnus, for a second there... I almost managed to forget. You guys talking about Magnus? I still can't believe he's Rick gone. Twenty fifteen, right before the How? Years. How could Since this have happened? Reason. To lose not just a friend, but a member of the Order of the Stone. All I know is he'd want us to keep fighting no matter what, and for us to keep blowing the crap out of stuff. <laughs> You're right. He would. Ah! Being emotional is getting us nowhere! What I want to know is what happened out there today? Why is that thing still alive? Is the My board? instructions were simple. You were the one in the middle of everything. What went wrong? <clears throat> you you don't. tell me. Excuse me? Well, you're the one who thought we could destroy the command block with a big old bomb. So the command block is still out there? Of course it is. Oh, great. Now, to make matters worse, we've gone from one weather storm to three! Our plan was a total failure! I should have cast the foul thing into the abyss. Soren, why working. didn't it break? The Formidabomb was, like, the strongest weapon imagined. Oh, uh, why are you asking me? Nobody's ever built one until now. Uh, I need a moment to think. 
Is he always like this? You have no idea. Well, he probably does. Just that jacket. Room. I recognize it. Lucas always wears that jacket. No. There were other people wearing that very same jacket when I was thrown from the monster. Ugh. It hurts just to think about. Just put it out of your mind. Jesse, if what Gabriel said is true... I mean, do you think? I thought for sure they were gone, but if they were just trapped in the wither storm... Lucas, your friends could still be out there! I know, and that means Probably. I... I gotta go after them. They might need me, Jesse. Well, Not because they do. I suddenly feel really <clears throat> busy. Easy, easy. I gotcha. <coughs> Let's go uh, talk to Lucas to change his mind. Gravel? No. Dirt? Don't think so. Lucas, what are you doing? I told you. I'm going after my friends. I thought the other ocelots were dead. But if they're not, I need to go find them. Look, I am grateful to you guys for bringing me this far. But I can't leave them alone out there. We need you can't just up yeah, and sure. leave, Lucas. You're part <clears throat> of our team. And you saying that just reminds me that I left my team. But Lucas... Look, you and me, we've made a pretty good team so far. I'd even call us friends. So I hope you'll understand why I need to go help my old friends. They do it for me. Same way you'd go back for any of your friends. We but we are helping them. Saving the world saves them too. <coughs> Isn't that just kind that of easy, easy convince? No, the right? number one thing you can do for them is to make sure we defeat those wither storms. I I guess you got a point. Okay, I'll stay. I just I just really hope they're all right. Thanks. I'm gonna go check on the horses. <coughs> Oh, easy there, Petra. I'm coughing. Just like me. <clears throat> Some leftover Cough. cobblestone might come in handy. <coughs> Let's talk to Ruben. I haven't spoke to him in a while. Hey, buddy. You doing okay? Of course you are. Wish I could say the same for everyone else. Talk to Petra. Petra, how are you doing? You feeling any better? Better is relative. If I just sit here and don't move or breathe, it's almost bearable. Man, if it wasn't for Ivor, she wouldn't even be like this. Ah, no kidding. That's not exactly true. Ivor built the Wither, sure, but he couldn't have done it without that skull I gave him. If I'd just taken a second to think about it, all I cared about was getting that stupid diamond. There's no way you could have known what would happen. No one's ever seen anything like this. Still, I'm gonna do exactly. everything I can to make this right. Petra, I know this isn't easy to hear, but you're too sick to be going anywhere. I'm not that sick. Maybe you should rest in this cave for a while. I mean, it's safe, defensible. If I say I'm fine, then I'm... <coughs> Fine. If you try to keep going, I'm afraid you're not going to make it. No. You need no to way. Rest. I'm not a quitter. You staying here is the right move. You'll never get better if we keep pushing you. But I want to be there for you guys. I know you do, and you will. Maybe you're right. It's the right call, Jesse. <clears throat> I hope so. Talk again. Talk to... These guys. Not gonna lie, but we've dealt with worse, right? Have we? How's it Doesn't going? Thing. Tell me, Jesse, who is this person? She keeps insulting me. One minute I think I'm talking to a friend. She's a member of the Order of the Stone. The Order of the what now? The Order of the Stone? It's the greatest band of heroes ever assembled. Hmm. And how do I know her exactly? I Is sense we have a history, but I feel I need a little reminder. Are you kidding me? You're both in the order. Really? Really? You go way back. It isn't working. He doesn't remember anything. <clears throat> Talk to him about your past, something only you would know about. Hmm. Like 
What? We haven't seen each other for... Uh, Talk um, about fighting the Ender Dragon. Yeah, I, I don't think so. I told that story way too many times. Which is why it might help. Ah, <sighs> okay, fine. Ender Dragon, scariest thing alive, right? Well, for most of the battle, it looked like we were goners. But you know who finally slayed that beast? Um, was it Jesse? What? No! It was you, Gabriel. You slayed it. Oh. Thank you for sharing that with me. And Jesse, thank you too. You've been a big help here. I, uh, I need to repay your kindness. I'm not sure how um. exactly, but I want to express my gratitude. It's no problem. I'd have done it for anyone. All the same, you have my thanks. Now then, tell me more about this Ender Dragon. Oh, I'm not even <coughs> sure where to start. Ruben. Sorry, Ruben. I don't really feel like company. Ruben! You got that mad? Not again. Tuck dead horses. Uh, why are you moving? Stop moving. There you go. Good horsey. Am I glad you came along? Just don't tell Ruben I said that. He might get jealous. How are the horses looking? Tired. I well, just saw but They're okay. Same as the rest of us. Well, I'm glad you're staying with us, Lucas. Yeah. Me too. Let's go. Ruben! <coughs> Don't fall off the edge if he's there. There he is. Don't run off on me like that, okay? <coughs> if I'll just leave that wither storm alone. Gabriel will be okay. I mean, he's supposed to be Gabriel the warrior, but instead he's you saw. That's snowflakes. Yeah, I guess none of the order are how we imagine them. Oh yeah, they think it's snowy by him, so yeah, it makes sense. Uh, the world needs us, Reuben. So much of it has already been reduced to bedrock, and it's up to us to save the rest of it. Well, maybe that is a lot of pressure for just a person and a pig, but to find a way. That's what I said, isn't it? I hear voices. Okay, I'm not going crazy, am I? This isn't about the past. It's about the future. There are three of those things now. It sounds like Soren. You say that like it's my fault. Was... It is your fault. Oh, take responsibility for what, I Soren? Worry. I did that by locking... That's great. I worry. <coughs> Soren, you need to listen to me. Oh, what good has ever come of that? What are you doing here, Ivor? Come to lock me in another room? I came to offer my help. Ha! He's been following us. It's not like that. You need to hear me out. What you don't understand is, you are all in very grave danger. <coughs> <laughs> Obviously! No, I mean specifically this group. The Witherstorm isn't acting randomly. It's following Gabriel. Gabriel? But Gabriel was inside it. You see, I may have programmed it to follow his amulet. You mean the Order's amulet? And the reason you didn't tell us that ages ago? Gabriel was gone. I didn't think it mattered. Right, except Gabriel gave the amulet to me. What? Exactly. I, I didn't know. Ah, Ivor, you fool. You've created a monster that's following Jesse, and it's only getting stronger. You don't think I realize that? Nothing can stop those things. Nothing even hurts them. Well, except Enderman. Enderman? Jesse's <coughs> right. The Withers' gaze passed over them, and they oh, went so wild. Part, exactly. We actually just saw a bunch of Endermen pull blocks off a Witherstorm. So... So, enough of them working together might be able to destroy a wither storm entirely. It's a promising concept, at least in theory. If I'm seeing all the pieces correctly. 
But to actually destroy a Witherstorm, we'd need hundreds of them. There's probably more than enough of them taking refuge in my fortress. An unintended side effect of you flooding the end. This is just like the old days, Soren. You and your crazy ideas. Hush, Ivor, for once! Ugh! Five, four, four, four. Question is, rhymes. how to bring the storms and the Endermen together? Endermen aren't pets. They don't follow orders. At least, not for mere mortals. Yeah, we know for a fact the Witherstorm will follow the oh. amulet. So, if we take the amulet back to your fortress where the Endermen are... Yes! Yes, that's it! We'll lead them straight into a massive trap! If we can't bring the Endermen to the Witherstorms, we bring the Witherstorms to the Endermen. Just one problem. Exactly. You're forgetting about the command block. Oh, yes. It's clear now that no weapon can destroy it. Not even a formidable. Actually, I may have <coughs> a solution to that. <coughs> you see, when I first took possession Every of time the one of these episodes, you mean stole it? Yes, well, I created a failsafe. A backup plan, just in case. Well, I'd say just in case is here. Ivor, how could you keep this secret? Oh, believe you me, keeping secrets believe is easy. Me. So I made something. English, an enchanting book. One that contains the power of the command block itself. Use it to enchant a weapon, and you'll be able to smash the command block to bits. Forever. Yes. Yes, that's it. It could very well solve all our problems. What are we waiting for? Let's go get that book. Just one problem. It's at my secret lab, which is sort of far away. How just far could it possibly be? Let's just say it's the farthest place a person can travel before being utterly... Oh dear, what was that? so quickly we're not safe anywhere are we well we can't stand around and wait for it we need to get out of here right now Ivor says that if we don't that thing will Ivor oh I'll be it is you a pleasure as always Eligard hello my name is Gabriel don't Somebody read pinch me Anyway, Ivor's figured out that the Witherstorms are drawn to the amulet, so we're gonna lure them back to the <coughs> fortress and destroy the command block with an enchanted super weapon. You figured all that out just now? The point is, we need to get yep. moving. We aren't safe. Not as long as we have that amulet. I'll take it. You can't. I can, and I have to. But you could be killed. Fisher. Axel, are you sure? Of course not. But you'll have three wither storms chasing you wherever you go. Yeah, if things get too intense, I'll duck into the nether or something. I'm tired of always being the selfish one. You just go make that super weapon. I'll meet you back at Soren's fortress. Well, Axel shouldn't have to do this alone. I'm going with him. I appreciate that. Well, I'm going with Jesse. I, I pledge to help, and that's what I must do. My friends are still out there somewhere. And you must do this for them. Guys, we need to go Let's now. Go. Hey, Jesse. Take the horse. Let's try our handshake again, just once for the road. The redstone wrap? You got it. Oh, well. Sorry. Real heroes don't need handshakes anyway. <clears throat> well, I was gonna do it. I'll see you at Soren's, all right? Back. Not if I see you first. Only them two are sitting here. Much further. <coughs>
<coughs> Every episode of Minecraft Story Mode, I just start coughing, and I absolutely hate it. Just for absolutely no reason. <coughs> Profoundly sore. Huh. I feel like we've been riding forever. I am telling you, we cannot go I to the far lands. Them. They're not just the edge of our world, but the limits of our comprehension. Oh, please. The far lands are a happy accident. That's Nature's way of keeping life interesting. No, no, no. They are perilous and unpredictable. Purlin noise, floating points. These are not matters to be toyed with. Far Hold on, back up. <coughs> what exactly are the far lands? Are you being serious? The far no. lands lie at the very edge of all things, where logic gives way to chaos. They're a dangerous place to visit, and a ridiculous place to construct a laboratory. <laughs> Just wait until you see it. Do those two never stop arguing? I don't know. I'm too hungry to care. Yeah, I'm starving. We all are. Maybe we should turn back? This isn't the time. Swamps are too dangerous. Back now. You never know what might be lurking around. What was that? My stomach. Uh, well, I'm taking a break. 